undefeated in Nightdale High School, 97 to 66, and I had a chance to catch up with Rob Brown, Chris Clemens, and Coach McGinnis to get their thoughts on tonight's game. Tonight you had 41 points. That's the most amount of points in school history. Tell me how you're feeling right now. Um, you know, I feel good. You know, getting a lot of love, and um, I just, I was, I'm just happy to be able to go back to Fayetteville. You know, get a chance to win the Chase Championship. Night game, Nightdale came out really strong and intense. What were you thinking during the game? Um, I was thinking win the whole time. You know, I just wanted to, I just wanted to, um, you know, score and just put more points up than the other team. Why did you touch him? What are you guys doing to prepare for Fayetteville on Thursday? Um, I don't know yet. We're just still celebrating right now, so we're, we're going to work on it a little later. You know, that's about a second. Thank you. Tonight you scored 27 points and you have the most amount of points in your career in school history. Tell me how you're feeling right now. I'm in beast mode right now. It's all about bucket. Beast mode. Nightdale came out really strong. It got a little intense in the middle of it, but tell me how you guys adjusted to their playing. Beast mode. And what are you and the boys doing to prepare for Thursday against 71st? Beast Buckets. mode. Buckets. Buckets. Thank you. <laughs>
This is the fifth time going to regionals in six years. Tell me how you think feel about that. Mm, I'm not that concerned about the past right now. All we're concerned about is the future, and that's what these guys have done. I mean, we're a family. Um, we're a brotherhood, and, and these guys are sticking together. Um, I mean, to see what, you know, Rob, I mean, Rob really set, has set the tone for us because Rob's like team, 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 team. It's all about team. I don't care about points. I don't care about minutes. And then he turned around and had, is the all-time leading scorer of all, uh, all time here at Millbrook High School. He's had a great career. He's been to four regionals. I'm, I'm happier for Rob. I, it doesn't really matter to me, you know, if I've had 10, you know, 20 regionals. It doesn't matter. I mean, what's more concerning is this team this year has, under Rob's leadership, has really bought in. Um, Chris really bounced back, you know, on offense. But the, the team defense has really picked up here in the past uh, couple of weeks. Our team defense, we're, we're doing a better job closing out on shooters. We're doing a better job rotating. So what's really been the difference is our team defense. Um, and, and, you know, that, that the second guys, they come off the bench, the reserves. I mean, they come out and get after it. And the Havoc group brings havoc. And it gives people problems. So they, they are creating a lot of problems this week. What are you guys doing to prepare for 71st in Fayetteville on Thursday? Wow, 71st. I did not know that. Well, 71st is a great team. They get up and down. Uh, we get up and down. So it's going to be a fun game. I mean, both teams get up and down. Uh, David Simmons uh, is a friend of mine, and, and they're very well coached. They play super hard and aggressive. So it's going to be a great game. Thank you, and congratulations. On Thursday, we will play at Fayetteville against 71st at 830. It is a whiteout, so we hope to see all you maniacs out there. From Millbrook High School, I'm Lindsay Cirillo. Huh?